Hi everybody, I'm Caleb Templeman from CalebTempleman.com In today's video I'm going to show you all how you can get a blurry background in your photos using Point Blur. Now obviously the main way to get that blurry background effect in your images is to use a professional DSLR camera with those manual focus capabilities. Let's say if you've taken a photo with your phone with no blurry background and if you want a blurry background, watch this video to learn more. Open up Point Blur, select edit and choose your photo. Press on full. So I recommend going on that third level. Now here's a trick that I use. Put this here to the full, go to touch, go it all the way up. What I recommend you doing is you do the outline first. So literally go along and go along the outline of the body. It may take some time. You can see our face is blurred. But we're going to add that a little bit later. Now, we simply blow our background. You can see the majority of our stuff has been blurred out. Go to freehand, tap on that, turn it down blue. And basically what you've got the ability to do is we've got the ability to remove, you know, the blur from a specific section of the photo. For example, my arm. Remove the blur from my arm and of course my face. Okay. Fix it up. Boom. And you can actually edit the blurness if you want to just go to touch. Go to like on point. And you can actually edit any kind of the blur. Like say if you want to get this. Blood a little bit more, like logos blood a little bit more. You can actually like go to the next level to do that. You know, you can get that real blur in it for like the shop section if you want. And then really you can do whatever other thing you sort of want. So for example, if we, if we want to blow this ATM, we can go like that. And we can use this feature to remove, you know, that blurriness like I showed you guys a little bit earlier. You can do any adjustments. You can see here with the phone, it's a little bit blurred. So we can actually zoom in to unblur, like get the specific points. You can zoom back out. You can just go like that, adjust it later. There we go. And you can see here, this looks uneven. So we can actually even it up. So when you're done, simply press on the save button. You're obviously gonna see ads to climb that, and that is now saved. Let's compare both of the images. Thanks for watching.